An enemy is just a friend I haven't worn down. Are you saying that you're the main character of a kid's cartoon? I'm saying that I'm going to be friends with you is both a promise and a threat. Oh. Twilight, but instead of a dramatic reveal about how Edward's a vampire, Bella just shows up to class one day and slides a copy of Dracula across the table to see what happens. He autographs it and slides it back. How dare you hide this comedy gold in the tags? Does anyone else remember Tack and the Power of Juju? Remember how hard Nick tried to make it a thing? Like, Tack was put in everything, it was treated as a main Nicktoon, but no one really got into it and he was just wiped off the face of the earth? Little did you know, he got rebranded. Think about it. Tech, a character we were trolled into thinking was a Nicktoons character. Now look at Neck, an actual troll. Tech, Neck, put it together, people. Donkey was right. Neck is truly a masterpiece. Okay, but whose idea was it to get Tom Hiddleston, a classics graduate, to get into character as Loki and stand on a go-kart in Pompeii yelling to all the inhabitants about their impending doom in Latin? Because honestly, that seems kind of like Christmas and a birthday combined level of treat for him. I'm feeling dangerously affectionate today. One might even say... Soft. Ah yes, soft. The Tumblr's version of thirsty, probably. I don't know. Sometimes ADHD is making schedules you know that you're not going to follow, but you're optimistic about trying anyway. Shut up, Danny! Am I going into this knowing I'm doomed to fail? Yes! Specific favorite dynamic is depressed person and the immoral but funny parasite monster slash alien they're host to. Ratatouille. <laughs> well, I mean, I mean, yeah. So, you're telling me in the span of 24 hours, thousands of staff bots have taken over Tumblr less than a week after this website asked us to trust it with their money? Ooh. I hate when people say, why or why not? The reasoning for my thinking should not have to be explained to you, mortal! The inside of my mind shall remain a mystery! Andy put up a gif of the milk spilling, like, like Patrick, you know, the little one. You may be an open book, SpongeBob, but I'm a bit more complicated than that. The inner machinations of my mind are an enigma. Egg recipe. Difficulty, egg. Time, egg. Ingredients, egg, eight whole egg. Step one, put egg on plate. Step two, look at all those egg. Step three, congratulations. You made egg. Sometimes you can pick up a cat and hold it, and it may make noises at you. Sometimes good, sometimes bad. That is the 50-50 jaw of cat. A limerick. Doesn't look like a limerick to you? Try this. A dozen, a gross, and a score, plus three times the square root of four, divided by seven, plus five times eleven, is nine squared, but not a bit more. What the heck, the heck, 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 heck? Poetry is not meant to be used like this! Aliens has everything you need in a horror movie. Body horror, anti-capitalism, cocky butch with a big gun, cool robot dude, and plot-relevant forklift certification. And aliens. Oh, fuck, shit, I forgot it also has aliens. One time I fell asleep with a half-eaten bag of chips on my chest, and while I was napping, one of my cats jumped up on me and chewed up the bag and sent the chips flying everywhere. And a bit later, I woke up completely covered in shredded bag and chip pieces. And the last thing I remembered, I had started eating some tasty chips. So for a short while, I was convinced I had blacked out and got into some sort of uncontrollable chip frenzy. I mean, wouldn't you? Sounds about right. I know I just called you dude, but I'm trying to flirt with you, right? Andy? My dude? Dude? By the way, I'm pro-quitting. This is a quitting positive space. If you're doing something and you decide, I don't like this, or I don't want to do this, then you should quit. Quitting is awesome. Grinding only works in video games. I quit all the time. It's great. Embrace the power of, you know what, fuck this, and see how it can improve your life. How long does someone have to be dead before it's considered archaeology instead of grave robbing? As an archaeologist, I find this a very awkward question. Answer the question, grave robber. Ugh, of course you're a Leo. You know what? Y'all don't get to have stars anymore. I'm putting them up on the shelf until you can learn how to use them correctly and navigate back to Spain or some shit. Fuck you.
Carpe diem, seize the day. Carpe noctum, seize the night. Carpe notum, seize the ass. Seriously, if you guys don't stop reblogging this, I'm going to carpe someone's neck and break it. Carpe column, seize the neck. <laughs> <laughs>